guys, welcome back to my channel. Today in this video, me and Naraya are cooking it up. We're actually doing something very different on my channel. For the first time ever on my channel, I'm cooking a non-vegan meal. So, brace yourself, okay? Well, she wasn't eating it, so. In a perfect world, everyone would eat just like me and everything will be just peachy king and fine. But Naraya, sometimes, and I know I get this question a lot in my videos, not, Naraya actually goes over her dad's house sometimes and he doesn't eat vegan at all. Not even a little bit. <laughs> so most of the time, Naraya is stuck in the middle and she asked me a long time ago when I even first started to do vegan foods if she can still eat meat sometimes. So Naraya still doesn't wanna eat completely vegan and so I compromised with I don't want to eat completely meat neither. Yeah, and she doesn't want to eat completely meat. So I compromised I get pretty sick sometimes. Yeah, I compromised with her and I allowed her to make the choice to eat sometimes meat, especially since like I said she goes over her dad's house. I have to co-parent. Mostly I allow her to eat lean meats and seafood. But I normally don't buy it. She normally either gets it when we go out to eat or if we're out somewhere and she wants to get it, but Today, I allowed Naraya to pick which meal she wanted to do and how she wanted to do it. So I actually got to choose other meals, even though Naraya chose a seafood dinner, I got to pick other meals and that's all thanks to Sun Basket. I was able to pick different types of meals based on our diet. So Sun Basket is actually sponsoring this video today. And if you are unfamiliar with Sun Baskets, they're actually a um, organically sourced meal kit. So they have something for you if you're pescatarian, if you are a vegetarian, they also do paleo, they do diabetes friendly foods. So it is actually a meal kit service, which I thought was really unique and why I agreed to even um, do this video is because I love a, a service that can help everyone because I know that everyone doesn't have the same diets People have different needs for their body because everyone is different I like how they have on their website that you can pick based on your diet what you want in your meal kit service so I actually got to choose three different meals and I personally picked the spicy Tuscan chickpea and lentil soup with garlic flatbread so they actually give you an option to go through and choose whatever you like and that's what I went with I actually went with the spicy Barco um, tofu burgers with chipotle cauliflower and guacamole as well and Naraya lastly got to choose what she wanted and what did you go with the Sicilian Sicilian strip paparito <laughs> she basically got the seafood pasta which comes with olives and oranges so that's what we're gonna be cooking today because Naraya wanted to cook her meal with me um, so I cooked the ones that I actually made myself throughout the week, but Naraya really wanted to make this one with me. So I'm gonna allow her to help me today, and she actually got to help me cook, right? Yeah, I love cooking. <laughs> so Sun Basket actually delivers these huge boxes to your door, which is awesome. They come very well packaged. They actually have like cold packs at the bottom so that your food doesn't spoil. They also have where you can choose if you want dairy or soy free, or if you, even if you're getting a meal with meat in it, you don't have to necessarily get a meal with dairy in it, which is very, very amazing because Sometimes people may eat meat, but they might not eat dairy. In your bag, what they do is they give you all the ingredients you need for your meal. So we're gonna go ahead and start with the seafood pasta that me and Naraya cooked. Again, I wanna mention that all of their ingredients are organic ingredients and they're carefully sourced, especially if you are um, someone who does not like a lot of toxins and chemicals in your food, like me. Let's go ahead and get started with the recipe. So first so up, we have our fresh pasta. Also gave us organic cauliflower. We also have our onions. What else did we have, Naraya? Shrimp. Also, they did give us some pitted olives and also we have the organic oranges, fresh organic parsley, and of course, if you want to use um, any type of chili flakes, they did provide those as well. So from your pantry, you can also choose if you want to add in more seasonings. Um, they do give you recommendations on the ingredient list if you want to use mm -hmm. salt, pepper, and olive oil or garlic salt or whatever you want to put onto your 
meal and add into the ingredient list. First thing you want to do is bring a medium sauce pot of salt water to a boil. Next, you want to go ahead and put in your pasta and cook and stir occasionally. You're going to do this for about three to two minutes or until you feel that it's actually ready. Drain your pasta and you want to reserve about one half cup or one fourth cup of pasta water. I actually reserved about one half cup. Return the pasta to the pot and drizzle in about one to two teaspoons of oil. Also, you want to toss your noodles in this so that it doesn't stick. So while your water is heating, you also want to go ahead and work on your vegetables. I had Naraya help me with cutting up the cauliflower off camera. So this is the cauliflower and we actually cut it up so that it is nice and bite-sized pieces so you don't want it to be too big. And thinly slice half of onion. Save the remaining onion for other use. So if you want to save any of these ingredients that they give you in the sun basket, you can definitely save any of the ingredients. In a large frying pan over medium heat, warm about one tablespoon of oil. Add the cauliflower and the onions to the pot and season with salt and pepper and then cook and stir occasionally mm -hmm. until the vegetables are lightly brown and starting to soften. So you can do this about six to eight minutes and it should be done within that time frame. Transfer your vegetables to a plate. Do not clean the pan. While the vegetables cook, prepare the shrimp. Rinse the shrimp. Then drain on a paper towel lined. Season lightly with salt and pepper. So in the same pan that you use for your vegetables, go ahead and warm one tablespoon of oil as well. You wanna go ahead and put in more oil because I'm pretty sure by now your pot is going to be pretty dry. Go ahead and add the shrimp to the pan and go ahead and cook it. It's recommended in the book to leave it in for about one to two minutes per side. Next, you wanna go ahead and add in more oil if needed and return everything back to the pan. Then you want to stir to combine the pasta. While the shrimp cook, prepare the rema remaining ingredients. Okay, so the remaining ingredients are going to be your olives and your oranges. So you want to go ahead and cut those into pieces so, so that you're able to add those to your pasta. Now you just want to put in your parsley and you want to garnish it with that. So don't put it in while it's actually cooking. Just wait till it gets on the plate and just garnish it with the parsley. Once you have everything in the pan, you have your um, seafood, you have your vegetables and your pasta into the pan. You, you can add in a little bit more oil as well. I actually added in olive oil about two tablespoons because that's what it said in the book. So I actually got a little excited and ended up stirring in the olives and oranges while it was on the stove. And I don't think Naraya really liked that because she said the oranges actually got too mushy. It was, yeah. It, so I would recommend adding in the oranges once you have the heat completely off. Now you wanna remove from the heat and season to taste with salt and pepper. So I actually ate a kale salad as Naraya ate the pasta. I love the kale salad. It tastes so amazing. Really yeah, Naraya actually liked it as well. So I really liked it. Um, I do like how on some baskets website they do have where you can get like side items with your food. So I ordered the salads with my food. You just want to go ahead and throw in the ingredients. They also give you organic vegan Caesar dressing, which is amazing because usually Caesar dressing is made with dairy. I thought that was really good that they didn't have like a non-vegan version because then I could partake in the meal as well. Well you could have made one of your concoctions if it. Yeah I will whip up a concoction in a minute. This is a really good recipe to do with your children because it's very easy. Now Naraya is a little older. She's nine years old so she was able to understand. do. Yeah she's able to understand and do a lot of stuff that was on the stove but if you have younger children then they have a little guide over here where children can actually 
they tell you what children can do. So they say kids can measure the cauliflower, peel the oranges. So I thought that was very unique that they put over where the kids can do something but just I so think, you can get them involved. I think that was actually cool that they did that because it's like they're doing the, the directions, but yeah. they're not literally doing the directions because like five, six, like they're going to be watching Mickey Mouse. So that was what we had for dinner. Naraya really liked the pasta. Um, she's acting kind of weird when she's tasting it, only because she- That's how, that's what my facial expressions do. So <laughs> it's not that I don't like it. It's just, that's what I do all the time, so. Yes, she is very picky. She wants to make sure that it's not nasty because if it's nasty, she won't put it in her mouth. Oh, <laughs> if it, even if it looks nasty and it's probably delicious, I just would not. Oh yeah, it has to have a good look to it, which is why I try my best to make it look presentable. So the great thing about this is Sun Basket has agreed to give my subscribers $45 off of their first Sun Basket meal kit, which is amazing because that's pretty that's a pretty good deal. And also because they have so many options for everyone, which like I said, it's awesome. Real ingredients, healthy ingredients right at your door. So I thought it was really good for you guys. I hope that you guys enjoyed this type of content. If you did, give it a thumbs up. And Naraya, do you have any last words? Yeah. Subscribe to my channel. Make sure you turn on the notifications on my mom's channel. And make sure you comment down below. Let me know down in the comment section if you guys are going to try out Sun Basket because I personally am going to probably get another meal from them just because I like how it was all prepared and everything was cut up for me and I didn't have to do much. It's just, I just it's, liked it. She's lazy like me, but she claims that she's not. I'm not lazy. Yes, she is, you guys. You should see her on the Monday. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. Peace.